Hey, what's up guys? So, it's Friday, um, I've got two videos coming out today, and so this is a what's in my bag, although my season's already over, so it was what was in my, anyways. This is the stuff I take to a game day, did, like, because my gear may change next year. But, so, here we are, we have my bag. I got this, like, two years ago. <laughs> at free at the sport at the LGBT sport summit sponsored by Nike. Yeah, I don't know what bag it is. They're just like, here, do you want red, blue, or yellow? I'm like, I'll take yellow. Even though this is technically full green. Anyways, so what do we got here? Far outside pocket, I have gloves. Battle gloves, got them this year. You know, sticky, really good. They don't stick so much now because they're dirty and used. Anyways, so I keep the gloves out there because, you know, I pull the gloves out and then I put them on and then I put like on my phone and my wallet and keys and key fob for the Prius and I put that in here and I zip it up. Because, you know, I'm supposed to be on the sidelines, I'm supposed to be in practice, I'm supposed to be out in the game, I'm not supposed to be Snapchatting. I mean, before, sure, and maybe during halftime if we go in I'll Snapchat or something, but not on the field. Why would you do that? So I always keep the gloves on the outside because they're easy to get to and they don't get squished up and like wadded up into a hole. Uh, in here is actually where I would put spare clothing. Like, cause I don't arrive to a game. Sometimes like, if I'm wearing this, if this is the away jersey. If I'm wearing this, I don't wear this actually. I wear normal clothing because I sometimes have to drive two or three hours to get it to a game. Rather than get it all mucked up and all that stuff, see, I also keep my kind of a helmet ball pump. Ha! Ah. The needle just fell out. And like when I'm out long snapping, I'm like, oh my ball, you know, balls are a little deflated. I don't want to be no patriot, so I just pull it out of my bag and I keep just a pump in my bag at all times. But this pocket right here, is where I put my clothing at the end. Not currently in here, but this little pocket, this is kind of like a school bag in a weird way. So like, the idea is you're supposed to put like pen, 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 calculator, I think? I don't know. I keep my eye black in there. I haven't had to use it this year too terribly much, but I keep it in this pocket. Again, also brought it. Outside pockets before we get inside to the rough of everything. Whoa, pouchy here. Get my inhaler. And on the other side, this is where I put like a bottle of Gatorade or Powerade or water or whatever I feel is the drink of choice of the day. Sometimes it's that body armor stuff. That's like, or coconut water. And you know, it's usually in the locker room and I can take a sip of it in between, like halftime or after a game or whatnot. During practices, I'll take it too. Also, I'll sometimes keep a power bar in there, uh, but that's usually for after practice, and that goes in the glove pocket. I'll put the power bar outside, or I'll keep it in the car. There's a lot of sun out, I keep it in the car in a safe place so it doesn't melt. So, in the main pocket. Yeah. So, we've got, I take my pants, and like I said, my jersey will be in here too. Just wearing it now. So, pants go in there and they just get simple pants folded. My girdle goes in there. Unless it's like practice early in the morning and then sometimes I just put it on. Uh, usually I just wear my undergear on me. Like if I wear sleeves or tights, I just put that all on. And don't have to worry about it because it's minor league. Sometimes we don't have locker rooms to change in. So I don't want to be stark naked trying to get leggings or tights on. So if it's like practice, I'll just wear leggings, put this on, put shorts over it, and then whatnot. But for like an away game, I don't want to sit in the car for three hours wearing a girdle, so I put it in my bag. Again, we're going with the away theme, so my cleats are in there. If I had, you know, black jersey, black pants, I'd be wearing my black, the black version of these, which is inverted. My ladder and cones because sometimes people forget and it works it it helps at practice because not everyone has everything not everyone brings everything so if you need to go through drills plus I usually take this is they're always in my bag this is the same bag I take out to go private train in this is what Willie and I use it's my ladder my ladder cones are down in here 
So, the hurdles I keep in the car. That's what's in my bag, and it is got two years of Ucky. It's gross inside. But, you know, it's a really good backpack. That's pretty much what's in my bag. I don't carry a lot that's in the bag. Going to game days and practice days and whatnot, I do take, you know, helmet and shoulder pads and whatnot. But what's actually in the bag, that, that's it. Practice days, like I said, I'll take two footballs, but then again, I won't have a girdle on my pants in here, so I make room. Because as a long snapper, you don't really want to have to chase a ball. Uh, even if you are long snapping <laughs> to a net. Also, like I said, game practice days, I'll take my helmet and obviously my shoulder pads, but the jersey will probably be on the shoulder pads. Uh, that way I can spend less time at practice fitting it over. And then again, in this pocket, for gone. I keep my mouth guard. I keep my mouth guard outside my backpack because I don't really want to lose this thing. Um, for those of you that wonder, it's the Sisu mouth guard. Tiny. Works really good, you know. Back on the 8th, I took a big old hit that I don't remember and my teeth are fine and I don't have a concussion. And then it went through an entire game. If you guys watched the vlog from last Saturday, uh, I, I didn't take my mouth guard out except for maybe once at halftime. Someone asked if I'm like, are you even wearing a mouth guard? And I went, oh, oh, yep. And they went, like, my, the guys on my team are still amazed by it. But that's what's in my bag. And I will go through another one, probably January when I pick up new gear or in case this backpack falls apart and I need to get a new one. But yeah, that's pretty much that. And I will catch you guys probably next week. I do plan on doing as many more football videos throughout the, throughout the rest of my season's over, but I know the rest of your seasons are starting up and that you're gonna wanna like watch some football videos. Now, you can comment below, do you want more like just general chat about football? Do you want tips and tricks? Like, do you want Willie and I to go out to a field and show some drills or whatnot? Do you want me to go over people's highlight film? I understand that you guys are developing highlight film right now, so I could go over at the end of the season. Willie and I could. So that's that. Like I said, I do plan on at least going through November, possibly all the way to the Super Bowl. Uh, maybe even commenting on NFL games if they happen to be a great, like, you know, like Monday night or Thursday night football was in a, had just like an amazing play. I might make a Friday video where I talk about it. So yeah, anyways, that's that. I uh, hope you guys all have a wonderful season. If you want to see any football video ideas, comment below. I'll catch you guys later.